so as you can see my hair is a mess um i just parted like the front section off where my real hair is it's like a part straight across and then i have cornrows in the back they're not perfect but just enough so it'll be flat um this is my half wig I did make this wig. Um, this is some kinky straight hair from Icy Hair. I have four bundles of 24 inch. And I um, I sold some combs into a dome cap. I think I have four combs in total. And then I hot glue gun, uh, glued the, the tracks to the wig cap. So uh, I'm gonna go ahead and put it on and do my thing. And then I'll come back and we'll talk about it. I'm just putting the wig on and securing the combs and the wig to my hair. Securing the combs in the front and the back. So all the way around. So this is what it's looking like. The back. So after I've secured that, I'm gonna go in and flat iron the front portion of my hair so it can blend. And since this is kinky straight hair, I don't try to uh, make it bone straight. I just do one, one, two at the most um, runs on my real hair. Okay, so I'm just combing it back to blending in with the weave so if you want to wear it down like this you could and it can still look um really natural just put some holding spray on it so you don't have any flyaways but yeah you up close okay so this next part is the most important part is to how to put the ponytail up. Now, once you put your ponytail up, it's imperative that when you section the hair, you section it so some hair is laying down in the back and you put the hair over it so you won't see any tracks. So I'm gonna try to, I hope when I turn around, you guys are able to see what I'm talking about. So here. And then you see how these tracks are here. You will want to take the hair surrounding it and cover that up. So no tracks will be visible when you put your hair in the ponytail. Trying to bend down so you guys can see it. Okay. So let's do that part. Let's put it in the ponytail. And you just section it to your liking, making sure that it's blending as much as possible. Keeping the tracks covered. Close. And then I'll just take small black rubber bands to secure the ponytail. Okay. 
comb that down. And then with my real hair, um, it's not really long, but it's not super short either. Uh, so what I do, I separate my real hair that I have the front in the front to cover up the, um, the tracks. And I wrap that around the ponytail. That's why I use a, a small black rubber band. So um, you don't need a lot of hair to cover it up to make it blend. And then I just take a black bobby pin and pin that part in the back. This way um, it's secure and blended. And then um, it depends on how I feel. Sometimes I'll lay down my baby hair, sometimes I don't. Like today, I'm not really feeling the baby hair look, so I'm not gonna do baby hair. And then you can take some holding spray if you just wanna secure your flyaways. So I have some got to be glue free spray just gonna spray a little bit because i still want it to look very natural okay so this is the finished product how to get a half up half down in less than 10 minutes so i'm gonna do a full 360 so you guys can see this is the front very cute very natural and as you guys can see in the back, no tracks or showing. This is a foolproof in between style. You know, it's fire. And like I said, I got kinky straight just so it can blend with my hair wheel and I don't have to worry about it. But yeah, this is the final product. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And tell me if you guys will be trying this style, okay? It's definitely cute. Cute and trendy. All right, guys. See you guys in my next one.